Hello everyone, this is now part three of my endurance playthrough, so um, we're carrying on with the awakening now. Let's get going, shall we? We've got to go to the encoded signal. So let's get a move on. <laughs> I really don't like water planets. Unless I'm building a water base. Oh, how far away is it anyway? Let's have a look. Oh, it's not that far. 46 seconds. Better not be in the middle of the frigging water. I've had that before. You get one of these <coughs> approximate locations and it's in the water and you can't land. <clears throat> oh look, there's a uh, dwelling there. That's a water location. Come on, mess has come up. <coughs> Probably send us back to that location. Well, more let's get it. Look. <coughs> How far? Five hundred. What? That's the distance. Friggin' hell. To be honest, I don't like these approximate location bits. Oh, it's just been bitten. We'll travel a few feet, have we? Oh no, that's going to turn away. Uh, oh, look at all that oxygen. I'll grab that. Wait. Yeah, don't die while we're doing this. See them all in the red um, grass. I got them all. Oh no, look. they're camouflage. Right, where are we going? That way. 551 used. Miles away. <coughs> I bet it is where we, where we passed that. Before. I'm not careful. <coughs> oh, wait a minute. Oh, it's a ship there. It wasn't what I thought it would be. Way to the... That we're going to get to. bit the seems if it's um a hyperdrive. Because it's obviously that. Yeah, see? Targeting range. Yeah, the freighter. What? It's up how the hell do I get up there? Well that way presumably. <laughs> I suppose it's um
we didn't fly past this. <clears throat> or if we did, I didn't know it's <laughs> big enough, isn't it? We can call Shippy anyway. Call. Let's call the ship first. I think I've got some. Have I? No, I haven't got any. <laughs> I always sell them. <clears throat> Log damage, partial records available. The signals led me to the wreck of a freighter. <coughs> Excuse me. Colossal fragments of metal scattered across the landscape. Were these messages nothing but the misfiring circuits of a long forgotten ruin? Nestled among the debris, I find the pilot's log, blinking, awaiting input. Request log. <laughs> Instead of displaying the sit log, the terminal spits out a strange sequence of numbers. They are followed by a short message. They normally come from the stars. Take flight. The schematic flight there is the Harbour Drive. Is attached to the end of the message. Take blueprint. I pull the blueprint from the computer, but the Harbour Drive blueprint is for a conventional starship, not a freighter of this size. Someone placed this here after the crash. Hoping it would be found. Cool. Oh, we've got to get a microprocessor, so we'll have to go up the station to get that. That's it. Begin hyperdrive installation. Well, I can't do that right now. <laughs> uh, I have to call ship it. Oh, no, don't say I haven't. I'm just thinking, um, I've done it again. Cannot land now. I thought I'd uh, not had enough fuel to do it, but we have. Because <clears throat> I don't remember refueling <laughs> the ship. <laughs> do a save. Well, we need to go to the station to get the um, microprocessors. Oh, well, now I need to refuel it. <clears throat> we need to find a planet with some uranium. So I don't have to keep doing this stupid um, fuel pods. Um, I don't know, well, we might have some. No, he won't. Will he? At base? Let's have a look. Where's my base? Where's the icon from my base? There. <coughs> Too much water. I'm not going to build much with the first base, um, the, the building, I'm leaving it as it is, because I didn't like this planet. <clears throat> it's okay the planet, don't get me wrong, but it's water planet, so I don't want my main base here. Um, this is just to start everything off, then I'll just delete this base when I make the next one. I don't want to keep this as a main base, it's just a waste. should have some at the dwelling, hopefully. We'll see. Nice slow landing, there we go. See, that is really basic, isn't it? <laughs> just that little square. Because I do like to um, city bait building. Um, should have, should have it here. Have a look. Yeah, cool. We want five, don't we? Ninety-five k. Right. Get the hard drive on. I know I don't need to go to the ship, but. Um, any space on technology? No. Okay, we'll put it down here. No, I don't want to put it out there. Go away. Um, we've got enough chromatic metal. Cool. So let's put that on. I can't put that on yet. That I want to put that on as well, but we need antimatter, which we haven't got. Um, so let's stick it on. Done. 
I've the driver installed. But we ain't got no fuel, so we're just gonna hopefully never go. Okay, let's to get it. Objective complete. Might come in, update, how do I take the restore, return to ship. Water <coughs> excuse me, <coughs> my throat's missing around again. Hyperdrive successfully installed. Hyperdrive fuel status empty, no, this is where we can get our <coughs> fuel antimatter as well. Hyperdrive is complete, perhaps I really will find answers out there amidst the stars. But without port cells I will be going nowhere, I need to find a source of antimatter, there we go, choose, okay, no. <coughs> right, hit the C button. What we got to do in slaves? Yeah, I've got to do a planetary scan. Let's do a save first. Right, let's keep going. the sound. Antimatter trace detected. Target locked. Let's go. Planet we haven't been to yet. I haven't looked at any of the planets on this system yet. <coughs> Apart from the one we've got there. Gamma intensive planet. Let's go. <coughs> uranium. Ah, we need some uranium guys. So, um, yeah, I'm going to have to mine some. <laughs> so we're getting diverted as well. Well, after we get the mountain, so we'll get that first. Yeah. Got to have uranium for the fuel. What's this planet like? Location. It's probably that one. Is it down there? Let's check. Let's just land there and see what happens. Ah, oh, can't be there. Surely that's eggs. I'm not going to go for eggs. We better land the location in case it's not that one. <coughs> if we can land anywhere here. Look, let me land. There we go. Yeah, I don't like this option in the game. I, I want to go directly there. <laughs> Not punt around looking for it. Radioactive damp, none. No sentinels, okay. Right, where are we going? That way. Is it going to be that one? It is, isn't it? <laughs> oh. Hey, sir. Ah. Yeah, I can't scan him. See, it just stays on this one, so I can't scan the animal yet. Yeah, it's this one. I'm not going to do any egg hunting today. Yeah, see? Here we go. I just want to get on in the moment, guys, so we're not going to grab any eggs. We need uranium, though. I've got to get some uranium, so we'll do that. Fuel for the shippy! Good nanites. Oh, rep as well. Oh, 
looking at a place. Let's go. Take blueprint and read log. You will find this when the time is right. 16, 16, 16, yeah, whatever. <laughs> there we got it, cool. Oh, good, I've got some content as well. Return. <clears throat> Blueprint recorded to catalogue. I like these, um, well, I like this. Craft Antimatter. Um, that's Craft Antimatter, shall we? Assemble Antimatter housing, which is what we needed for the pods that we found and oh to see an animal wants to come and bite me sorry mate you can't have me took a lot of to kill him feline liver um I'm a sugar we have to call shippy Housing, do that now. Oh, I'm running out of space here. Um, I'll get rid of that. Craft a warp cell, you don't say. Cool. Put it in the ship. I've been really long to space to test interstellar system, but I'll oh, do a save first before we do that. Oh, look at that small amount. I've noticed lately, um, have they actually reduced the amount of nodes that we find? Because I've been mining off camera the um, copper, and they're like this, they're all small, like this. So, I wonder if they've done that on purpose. I'm not giving you so much nose. I haven't found any big ones yet anyway. All these small little lumps. <coughs> we'll do this um, for now. I won't search for any more. Don't want to keep recording uh, me mining too much. But I don't particularly want to do too many pause videos because I prefer to upload them at 25, 60 by 1080. If I do the raw file, it does take a little bit longer to upload, but they look better on YouTube than the smaller version. Okay, let's find that one call. How many did we, how much did we get? <coughs> Well, no, well, that's not a lot, is it? Um, well, anyway, that'll do for now. Let's grab this. Okay. 
Oh, missed a bit, look. there's a bit, I saw a bit. There we go, look. Quite a bit all. <laughs> there you go. Oh, another bit down there. Right, out in space. <clears throat> Let's put that in the ship. System, so once we've done everything, I'm not going to use the uh, fuel yet until I really need to. In space, you access the galaxy map. Right, let's go. Tell us where to go, will it? Oh, we'll just go anywhere, can't we? Let's go to the first one. Oh, I, I haven't got a, um, what you call it? Let's just get there. See what it's like. Our first jump. Yuki Galaxy first contact, three planets, Gek again, mining balance, medium, unknown planet, oh, we're going to get it known now, there we go, <coughs> Starship Mining Resistance Report, hyperdrive error, warp fuel depleted, searching for fuel source, searching, searching, obtain, warp fuel sources, 16, 68, whatever, Accept guidance to fuel source. Accept. Guidance accepted. Plotting route. And here we go. Where are we? Thank you. Right there. Arrive in one week. More <laughs> <coughs> to the other panel. Yeah, I like the camera views. Could do a bit more. They could have done it a bit more so we can actually go right the way round. That'd be cool. Unknown planet. Scan it, see what it is. Foaming planet. <coughs> it's got bubbles. It's a bubble planet. Ah, approximate location again. I, I really don't like this. I'd rather be directed directly to the point where we're meant to go. And it's probably there. Yeah, it's going to be here. Yeah, it's there, mate, okay? See? Bubbles. Right. Meb scale system, first contact. Oh, I didn't see what the plane was like, never mind. Get the word. Get system again. Wait, can I fit under there? No. <laughs> right. Let's go and get. The fuel, the heart of the anomaly. This rock is unlike anything I've encountered on my journey so far. Everything about it is so obviously alien, so obviously out of place. As I share, stare at it, words form themselves in my mind, a strange fragment of broken speech. Is it traveller? Is it friend? It's traveller. <clears throat> it feels strange, responding to questions I am unsure that I am being asked. But something has clearly taken notice of my reply. I am overwhelmed by a sense that something has awoken, that someone is watching me. It forms another question. Is it first? Is it last? It's first. I don't think it matters which answer you give. 
<clears throat> I do not know how I am being spoken to. This monolith is ancient, and I cannot escape the feeling it has asked these questions many times over. It asks again. Have they seen the Crimson Eye? Has the Crimson Eye seen them? Both. The Crimson Eye was when we saw the red ball come out of the um, damaged machine when we uh, first got to the ship. Light ahead of anomaly exceeds safety parameters. Breach detected. Alert. The boundaries fall. The walls collapse. Your universe awaits. Find us, traveller. There we go. We get another warm cell for free. Find the mysterious metal zone. Make your way into space. Okay, cool. You were safe? I like bubbles, man. I don't know, I just do. It feels like you've got the bubbles on your look. <laughs> Let's have a look. So we saw copper, gold, and silver. Invisible jade winds. Okay, cool. But uh, we, we need to get on. We need to go and get the awakening properly started. So, always do a save, guys. Let's put the wall. So, can we make another one? We should go and make another one. Let's make. Oh, what do we need? Antimatter. Oh, come on. What am I doing? I don't know what I'm doing, do I? <laughs> yeah, I'm going to make another one, so we got two. Okay. Right, back out and just... Oh, save. Let's go. I like this uh, planet, which are reasonably flat. Like this. It's cool. Because you can see for miles. Well, more or less. I don't know if this will have anything on it, but... We won't um, explore these planets yet. We need to get on. So let's go. I'll do all that once we've um, started the awakening proper. Well, I like the colour of the system. It's not too dark, not too light. Oh, that looks cool, look. But it's too much water. Again, see, it's water planet. Unknown discover. Oh, the base confuses us. A Xeno colony, Sarbol, so you know, you know, but anyway, what we got to do? I'm in space, come on, I want the update. Exploring about planets or searching a new system, access to the galaxy to map is actually built. Oh, wait a minute, I've forgotten what to do here. Um, the Awakening, Explore Guide, Base Computer. I want to read the strange message. The boundaries of the walls collapse, your universe awaits. Find yourself in space. Use the galaxy map to search for clues. Hmm. Can't remember what we do here now. <laughs> oh, let's get some trichemus, they call it, isn't it? Boom. Let's go and have a look at that Xeno colony then. Let's go and have a look over there. I don't like it because it's water again, but. Wait a minute, how many planets are here? Hmm, let's go and have a look at it anyway. New Uderi, Uderi, unmapped. There's still only about planets, I'm searching a new system. I can't go to the map with that, I can't make that one. <coughs> I can't remember what happens now. It's been a while since I've done this, so <coughs> I don't remember this happening like this. Because it normally directs you, and it hasn't. We might end up going back to the base and see what happens. That looks so cool, doesn't it? It looks good. Apart from the fact that it's got... It doesn't look like it's got a lot of water, we'll see. Ah, <coughs> oh, come on, storm. Oh, oh, that's horrible. 
<coughs> Excuse me guys, sorry, my throat is um, messing around again. Oh, it's horrible. Don't like it at all. Let's just discover it quick. No, I don't like this. Don't like this planet like this. I ain't gonna do any searching along here, just just discover it. See what it's got. Oh is that a worm? Yeah look, there we go. Kill it, kill it. <laughs> uh, cool. I didn't look at what the planet had, let's have a look. Mild rain, intermittent, low, abundant, aggressive. Well, oh, let's grab these quick. Hmm. Well, to be honest, I haven't got a clue what's going to happen now. Um, oh, yeah. Not enough launch tool. No, really? <coughs> Who is now? I'm going to put one in the other. I don't like this at all. Oh, wait a minute, incoming message. What have we got here? Incoming transmission, source unknown. You are not uh, alone. I have stone. Please identify yourself. I'm identify yourself. You left me. Why did you tell him you don't understand? Of course you'd say that, of course you'd just like the others. Ask who you are speaking to. Well we know who this is, don't we? There is no reply, the communicator falls silent. Though the channel remains open, cool. We found him. Foaming planet. Coordinates received. No, don't send me back to that crappy planet, please. Please don't send me back to the crappy planet. Oh no, somewhere else. Has it got a moon as well? Look at that little one. Oh no, it's an uh, asteroid, isn't it? High radio source planet. Gamma. Oh, more uranium. We can get some more uranium there. Cool, let's go. <coughs> And we need to visit the space station as well. Once we've done this bit, upgrade our suit. I think this is not going to be such a long video, guys, because I've got to go. What time is it? Yeah, I've got to go out shortly. So, no pauses on this particular video, hopefully. I'll get it up later today. Oh, see what that is? Ah, no, no, don't do you go away. On a tray. What the way the ship went? Went a bit weird. Not another horrible planet. I hate these mountainous planets. Strangest coordinates, approximate location. Well, we're going to go to the grave, aren't we? Well, it's a little bit mountainy. I just don't like these ones. coloration though. I like the, um, I don't like the topography but the colour's nice. Oh, let's get I didn't look at the planet again. No, that way, how far was it? 275, not too bad. I haven't got much space, so I'm nearly full up, yeah, look. I need to sort out my inventory. It's got to be copper, isn't it? 
Oh, anyway. Oh, look. Oh, hello, fella. Are you going to try and bite me? Yeah, I know I can go and get more oxygen, but I can't be arsed all the time. <laughs> We're nearly there. It's a graveyard, isn't it? Targeting range. There we go. Oh no, it's crashed ship. Oh yeah. Oh, I like that ship as well. It's gonna. Hmm. I like that style. It's going to cost a lot to repair it. I thought it was a grave, but the grave comes later. There are no signs of life. There's only the static of a broken communicator. Extract the record. Whatever message was once here has been scrambled beyond recovery. All I extract is the pilot's name. There we go, Artemis. Whoever they were, they are long gone. The only other uncorrupted data is a set of plans on an upgrade for my mining beam. Oh, crap. Pulse but I don't use pulse but thank you. Continue. Let's grab this. We're going to um, get the special Nexus in a minute. When we uh, get in the ship, we need to repair it first. I do like this design. Hmm. Um, I'm thinking the idea, I don't know. Falcon of what's it? What do you know the name of it? Falcon of the Mink or something. Falcon, Falcon of the Mink, you could pull that lot to repair all that lot. Um. No, I'll probably just scull it. Let's have a look at what we need to repair. Not the hard drive. Hmm. I've got to take it anyway. Claim ship. I know, I know. Um, hydrogen jelly. to the station but first we're going to get a message come through if I remember right um hematic seal how many one and one so one of those and one of those no I never bother with a shield let's just quickly do a save you like the ship though. I know the shield's down. We're gonna get a message. Here we go. Artemis Anthony, we received your signal. Is it first? Is it last? Well it ain't Artemis. <laughs> Time for the truth. You have their signal, but you are not Artemis entity. Tell the truth. Your signal is familiar to Nada. We have been in contact before, I think. This would be a good time to come aboard, yes? A proper introduction to our home. You're really cool. I like this bit, because we can get our gold ship. <laughs> But I like this one as well, but I'm not going to be bothering repairing it. What are we in 39 minutes? Okay. Once we've had a chat with Nardo, I'm going to call it here. Because I need to go, otherwise I'm going to be late. My friend won't be very happy. <laughs> right, let's go. Chat with Nada. 
and I can pick up all the nice stuff that I can get from the what you will call it guy, this guy over there. You need to chat to everybody on this station as well. I am Priest Entity Nada, Divergent Corvettes. Welcome to our anomaly. Our home here is pleasant, yes? Polar's own design, the perfect bubble. Beyond the Sentinels, beyond vengeful Corvax. Nada watches time come and go. Ask about Artemis. A traveller entity, perhaps they are known to you. I do not know their number. Nada does not care to think about iterations as numbers. They were lost to us, highly prob improbable. Our anomaly is lost to the Sentinels, but none shall be lost to the anomaly. The Corvax watches me. There is a patience, an organic tilt to the way they hold their metal shell. Ask about Nada. Nada awoke with the death of Corvax Prime. Could not understand why such things happen. Why we are alone. Now I am divergent. The convergence do not see through my eyes. Nada is not alone anymore. Nada is with Polo friend. Now many other friends busy. Our convergence is small, but Nada happy. Nada's carapace pulses with a gentle light. There is something familiar about them. Ask about Polo. Polo friend found Nada. Found my signal. Nada is safe. Now, Nada finds other signals. Makes others safe. This station has been calling to me since I woke up on the planet. Perhaps it called to Artemis as well. Ask about the space station. Beyond what is outside, I normally wander free. Free like Nada. To observe, to search. The Sentinels, the Atlas, they do not care for this place. I feel their eyes hunting us. Nada watches me, judging my reactions as they speak. Leave. Speak with Polo, friend traveller. Perhaps they might know more about missing Artemis. They perceive things more clearly than Nada. Polo? Specialist Polo. Friends everywhere, if only you know where to look. Friends in all shapes, all sizes, all places. Artemis friend, you are where they should be. Does not seem possible, but all things are possible. Such is the universe. We will find them, no doubt. There's always a signal, always a trace. Ask how. Our home will see to it. When you leave, you will not be where you were. You will be closer. Or maybe not. Discovery is exciting, yes? Yes. <laughs> Before you leave, perhaps spend some time with other friends. We all help each other here. That's it. We've got to uh, speak to all the people on the station. But I'm going to do that off camera, guys. Um, I need to get, get going. So I hope you enjoyed this little session. We've come to the um, Nexus or the anomaly, the space anomaly. We can call it at any time. And also we can get our space suit upgraded here if, if you haven't done this before. Um, so let's just do that now here, as well as on the station. So for each different um, system you go to, if you call in the anomaly, so you can upgrade your space suit here as well as at the station. So let's do that. <coughs> um, that's 5,000 units of that, the cargo will be a bit more, isn't it? That's 500,000. I have a way of doing this. The cargo is going to be 500,000. I'm not going to do that. Let's do the technology. That should be a bit cheaper. 1,000, of course. So let's upgrade it there. <clears throat> I'll do a quick save. And then we'll call it. Because I need to speak to everybody on the station. But I'll save right now. Because I need to go. Wait. And then come back and... Have a chat with everyone. But uh, I'm not going to record that, guys, because it's, um, it's all been done before, isn't it? So I do like this ship. But it's too much to repair. But we'll get to that in the next one video. Good, done a save. <coughs> okay, guys, this is where I call it. I hope you enjoyed it, and I thank you so much if you got this far. 
and I will catch you in my next one. See you soon.